abode of snow, a mountain range of Earth's highest peaks has always attracted its beholder in a magnificent way. Naturally, geographically and religiously significant Himalaya has mesmerizing history of its origin. Today, here in this video, Edison Nepal presents the amazing history about the origin of Himalaya. Himalaya is known for its historical, religious and geographical significance. Historically, it has a lot of relevance. It served as a god from various invasions, a border and a meeting ground for different races, culture and religion. It formed the divide between India and Tibet. But that barrier didn't stop individuals from pursuing adventurous journeys to explore the unknown side of the Himalaya. People traveled for religious and trade purposes. The Trans-Himalayan region was a key center for trade and commerce. With the famous Silk Route, this region first gained importance during the early Han Dynasty, that is 206 BC to 8 AD. The route connected Central Asia with South Asia and created a bridge between culturally and religiously diverse countries such as India, China, Afghanistan, Nepal and Bhutan. Himalaya was also a witness to the Indus Valley Civilization. In 1856, in the foothills of the Himalayas, the twin cities of Mohenjo-daro and Harappa was discovered. So Himalaya has a rich historical background to unfold. The Himalaya is not merely a geographical feature, a range of mountains. It epitomizes a people's civilizational identity that goes back to the dawn of the history. If this majestic mountains were not there, the rain cloud sweeping up from the Indian Ocean would have passed over the Indian subcontinent into Central Asia, leaving it a burning desert. Archaeological evidence about Himalaya history reveals that urban civilization first emerged in the valleys of the rivers coursing down from the Himalayan mountains. When man elsewhere was cautiously emerging from their cave shelters, spectacular cities flourished at Mohenjo-daro and Harappa in the Indus Valley. About the origin of Himalaya, it can be said that millions of years ago, a collision between Indo-Australian plate and the Eurasian plate resulted in the formation of the world's highest mountain Himalaya. There were several steps in the formation of the Himalaya. The first phase was the collision of Gondwana plate and Angara plate. The seabed raised into longitudinal ridges and valleys. In the second phase, the collision was very effective and powerful. The Tethys bed rose to a great extent to cause the final retreat of the sea. During this, the Great Himalaya and the Tibetan Himalaya were formed. In the third phase, the lower Himalayas were formed. During the fourth phase, the Himalayas ranges elevated and the sub-Himalayas were raised. The final phase determined the present structure of the Himalaya. The Himalayan range has many of Earth's highest peaks, including the highest Mount Everest. The Himalaya include over 50 mountains exceeding 7,200 meters in elevation, including 10 of the 14 8,000 meter peaks of the world. Thank you very much for watching this video. Please do not forget to like, share and subscribe.